Hello, hello, hello. This is Rich Kale here on YouTube, Rich Gen X elsewhere, and it is time to continue with the Ponya, the complete journey. Okay. Now we just figured out how to uh, get that battery acid out. And there's a lot of battery acid in there. I just need to somehow Toro! get... <laughs> Any... I have to figure out how to get a container. <laughs> and today, children, Uncle Rufus will show you how to draw blood from a full-grown bull. And uh, this is one way how not to do it. Toro! Hey, I... <laughs> you have to be age six or older to use this device. Oh, oh, how great. boring is that? Okay. Can I go down here? No. Hmm. Cut door, lever, windshield. Alright, maybe we can find something in the emergency station. I don't know. Anything, anything, anything. No. There's a hole in the platform. Yes, there is a hole. Since the retirement home sunk into the ground, they don't let me work in the trash mines for community service anymore. Huh, maybe our system of justice is working after all. If the fetters weren't so wide, I could attach them to the hole over there. Ah, but they are too wide. Oh, so there is something I need. Do I have anything I could attach? Not the divining rod. But there's no water here. No surprise, it hasn't rained for weeks. No. Okay. It doesn't have to... What about the siphon? Can I... Put the funnel to the tunnel, my dad used to say. I wonder if this is the situation he might have referred to. No. Okay. Hmm. So we gotta figure this one out. Anything? Hmm. Parrot. Can I? Hey, I don't abuse pets, and in exchange, they're more than happy to help me with my experiments. Oh. Ah! I'm starving! Do I have something I can feed this parrot? No, nothing. Uh, let's check the bar again. No, nothing yet. Damn. Okay, back to the village. Wait a minute. I just had a thought. That's a great idea. All that's missing is a blowpipe. Oh! though if I could be so that's a great idea all that's missing and a sufficient safe distance okay so I need a 
This is where Tony's budgie cage used to hang, but he couldn't cope with her, so he skedaddled. He died of old age. Yeah, whatever you say. After you accidentally infected him with progeria. Yeah, you, you know, I like my version better. Okay, stuff. So, I need a tube to make a blowgun. Uh, great. Hmm. There's gotta be something I can use for a blowgun. I have a feeling I need a damn blowgun! Hmm... Nothing in there. Sofa... Oven... No. Nice hole. The mouse skedaddled long ago. Which doesn't mean that its plan was better than mine. Hmm. I'm not sticking my hand in there again! Okay. Then don't. Hmm. Is there anything out here I can use? Hmm. No. Great. All right. And there's nothing up in the in quote Bilfus's room. Uh, that's the thing about point and clicks, though. You have to explore, contain, protect. No. Oh, this my headache's feeling a little better now. I need a blowpipe. How the hell do I get a blowpipe? I don't think there's any in Wenzel's house. Did Wenzel leave there yet? No, he's still standing in the way. Isn't he? Rufus, so how do you suppose you'll convince the mayor? Well, I, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm... Uh, I can't get past Wenzel. Pull lever. I've waited long enough. Now it's time for which I have plenty of time. I hate lines. Yeah, I know. Is there something in the assembly hall I'm overlooking? Let's see. Hmm? Cardboard box. <sighs> see, I don't know what I need. Dumped. I need a push in the right direction. That's what I need.
I miss something? I think I missed something. And that could be part of the problem. I need to find something. Alright. At least we don't have to go too far to find it. Off to the emergency station. Okay. So let's see. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, I think I got those. Firefighter's cabinet? Let's see what that does. Okay. Right. Ah, of course. Oh. Now, I think I see what I have to do. Yeah, that makes sense. Makes tons of sense. Yep! Look at that. That answers that question. The foot fetters is what I needed. Huh. I knew there was something about that. I just didn't put it together. Okay, so I have the lock pick. No great in the world can... <laughs> there, it moved while you were blinking. Yeah. Alright, let's see if I can use that. <laughs> yep. Oh, stupid me. Pardon, I forgot which recording system I was using. What happens if I do this now? Interesting. Crap. Locked. Distrust everywhere. Ah, but I have a lock pick. Ugh, I hate syringes. Luckily, I've developed an immunity to tetanus. I wonder what that stuff tastes like. I've only ever been injected right into the heart muscle so far. Aha! So I've achieved some... A stimulant! I... <clears throat> I can't keep clicking on the wrong thing. Now, I have stimulant, I have a lockpick. And if I recall right... Now I can make the coffee powder! Okay, oh. I have a feeling she's not gonna let me do it.
Let's see. Since I now have the stimulant. All right. I'll call this blend Rufus Reckless, the Maiden Slayer. <laughs> or Savior. Hmm. No, Slayer sounds much better. Okay, well now we got that. So now I just have to get water. We got Wenzel out of there. We did all that fun stuff. if I can get him to move now. Does at least have the stimulant to get the part of the coffee together. What do you express for? Rufus, so how do you suppose you'll convince the mayor? Well, I, uh, I'm, I'm... Hello, Lottie. You again? <clears throat> you, you again? I'll skedaddle. Don't let the door hit you. I wonder if... I wonder if the number will help. Is it my turn already? Yes, it is! I <clears throat> already called your number, didn't I? Yeah. He wouldn't know what to do. He doesn't even know. Okay. Now I can go in. When? Rufus, so how do you... Well, I... Rufus, so... Well, I... Okay. How do I get him to move? Alright. Because until he moves, I can't get in there. Okay, Wenzel, I want to get in to see the mayor. Ah! Okay, I have to talk to you. It's about... Ah, I got in, finally. Lotech? Oh. Uh, what? Who's disturbing me? Whoa. Are you really sleeping in your desk? This is the mayor's traditional resting place. Before me, your father used to sleep in here. That was oh, before wow. he betrayed the community. <laughs> well, I can totally understand that. Well, he left you behind, too. Be, be that as it may, who sleeps in a desk anyway? Admittedly, the desk isn't aligned correctly with the planet's magnetic field, but your father had a device installed to correct that. What? Well, um... I'm here for the Elysian girl. They all are, but you're too late. The hearing is over. Over? 
I was the one who found her! But it was me who found her! As far as I know, it was Panic who found her. Well, I found her first. And you just left her lying there? Uh, no, it was uh, different. With your attitude, you wouldn't even stand a chance if the hearing wasn't over already. Ah. Uh, but, but I saved her life. I find that hard to believe, considering you're responsible for 90% of all injuries that happen in Kuvac. Well, but 90% of those have been my own injuries. Listen, Rufus. Whenever chaos breaks out in Kuvac, you are responsible for it. As far as I know, you might even be responsible for that girl falling from the sky. Uh, no, it was different. With your attitude, you wouldn't even stand a chance if the hearing wasn't over already. But I have to help her return to her world. Yeah. To Elysium? <laughs> That's a good joke! You should know better than anyone else that there's no way to leave Deponia. Nothing that ends up on Deponia will ever leave again. My dad made it. That's neither probable nor verifiable. I know that's what you'd like to believe, but yeah. I believe it's more likely that your father ended up crashing into some trash heap. With your attitude, you wouldn't even stand a chance if the hearing wasn't over already. That's too bad. How exceptionally reasonable of you. I've made my decision, and there's nothing you can do about it. I'm starting to run out of good arguments. Yeah. Finally! There is a god! Are we done here? I really need to go to the assembly hall. You bet. Oh, now what? All right. The girl belongs to me! Wrong! I've already made the decision! I'm starting- Finally! Are we done here? Uh... You bet. Oh... Now what? What? Instead of just moving the desk, yep. my dad preferred messing with the planet's magnetic field? Well, he was the most egocentric and stubborn person I've ever met. That's a lie! Oh yeah? Why do you think he left you here? Because he didn't care about anyone but himself. Not even his own son! Not even for his own son! Pretty ironic that you've become just as egotistic as he was back then! Egotistic? Me? Ha! Ah, just recently, I risked my own life to save a girl from the clutches of the Organon! Completely without ulterior motives, I suppose! You better believe it! My ass! Ah, you'll be surprised, Low Tech! I will save the girl! And then everyone on this planet will realize how selfless I really am! But then, it'll be too late, because then, I'll already be sitting in some cocktail lounge in Elysium and laughing about you fools and how you still have that to live in this junkyard. You'll see. I can't stop thinking about what you said, that my father manipulated the planet's magnetic field. Well, get over it. Your father installed that device for a reason. He manipulated the magnetic field so he could sleep in harmony with the field lines. I can't imagine how that's supposed to work. Yeah. Well, it does work. I sleep like a baby. <sighs> the only downside is that carrier pigeons are constantly crashing into my window. When does the post office open? Whenever I feel like it. I am the mayor, you know. Mm. Stupid rule. That was your father's idea. Um, stupid, but not bad. Not, not bad at all. Okay. I officially want to deregister my residence here on Deponia. <laughs> you don't even have your own residence, do you? You're mooching off your former girlfriend. Yeah, well, at least I'm not sleeping in the drawer of my desk. Watch your tongue, son. This is the mayor's traditional resting place. Huh. If only your father were here to put you in your place. You know darn well he worked here before me. Oh yeah, you mean he slept here. You don't even know what real work is. If you put in a little more effort, you could have followed in your father's footsteps. My father's footsteps led away from this dump, and I'll get away from this rock too. And you think you'll reach your goal without a serious effort? Huh. I'm beginning to understand why he didn't take you with him. Okay. Ouch. Okay. 
when does the post office open again? Whenever I feel like it. Right. Okay. The girl belongs to me. Wrong. I've already made the decision. I'm starting to run out of good arguments here. Finally. There is a god. Are we okay. done here? I really need to go to the assembly hall. That's all. No. That's it. Well, then just beat it. I need to get to the assembly hall. Ah, terrific. Hmm. hmm. I kind of know this symbol. Huh. He's gone. Well, never mind. Get that cushion. Oh, hello! What's this? A gadget that manipulates the planet's magnetic field. Yeah, this hmm. could have been my idea. What's this? Next, please. Hmm. Guess I'm last in line. Whatever. Who could possibly succeed except for me? Oh, look at this! A glass. Mm, and a keyhole. <laughs> yeah, that would be fun. <laughs> okay. Well, now we got more things done. What's this? S O. L O N G Y O U F U C K E Damn, where was I? There's a message from the mayor of Buzo Westfar. O O I C U R N E D O T. Huh? Either a cat was jumping up and down on the keyboard, or the operator must have gotten that all wrong. Yeah, that does sound odd. There's a message from the mayor of Buzo Westfall. O O I C U R N E T. Huh? Either a cat was jumping up and down. Very possible. All right. However, I think we've gotten to about a half hour. I think. Let me see here. Oh, wait a minute. That's a water symbol. Let's see. What's this? A hidden compartment? Well, looks like Dad's secret will see the light of day after all. Alright. Let's get that key in the cupboard. <laughs> a key. My dad knew I'd be clever enough to find it. I wonder what I'd get for it if I melt it down. Rufus, key to the booze cabin. This might cap. be unnecessarily complicated, but I'm certain Dad wanted to make sure that I'm the only one who could get this far, get to his big secret, his legacy. All right. His liquor cabinet. <laughs> okay. Alright. So we found booze. Alright. So, got all the fun stuff here. Ah! Now that makes sense. Things are making sense now. I mean, yeah, that battery is still flowing acid out, which is like, say, that's a lot of acid in one battery.
Ha ha! I've siphoned the acid without injuring myself. I'll drink to that. Blech. You dipshit. <laughs> Alright, so let's see here. What do we have? We've got Energize, which means the acid. We got to the mayor, but unfortunately he's not helping us out here on this one. So I gotta get water, clear and exhilarating. Which, uh... Oh, good grief. Now I know what I have to do here. So... Let's do this. Ah! Uh-huh! Brilliant idea, Rufus! What could a lonesome bull crave more than a well-chilled glass of gnat's piss? Okay, I'll use the cap. Main thing is that it worked. Now, let's energize this guy a little bit more. Although this actually does not work. Toro! Hey, I said Toro! What, what good is it being the best of matadors if the bull isn't even looking? Aw, does that upset you? Well, <laughs> an accomplished matador like me knows how to bring the blood of a bull to a boil. Or whatever liquid it is that's pumping through those tubes. Now, we actually have what we need. Draw blood from an enraged bull? <laughs> Child's play. What? Bull's blood. Check. All right. I got blood, bull blood, and let's see, what would be next? Uh, okay, exhilarating, energized, and we just need clear, which, uh... But now I gotta get water. How do we get the water now? Well, I suppose there's something I should have done. Yeah, quiet bull. Alright, I'll have to figure it out later. Since I have to get water again, so I have to figure out how I get the water. Clear. Quiet bowl. Unless I have to go back to Wenzel's and get the water. Which would make sense. Ouch. It's very possible that's the solution. I'm just wondering. Now I got that clean water here. Can I uh, use it here? I don't want anything to do with Wenzel's stinking well. Okay. So what do I do to get the wen the I may have to look that one up. Because I think it has something to do with the booze. Because I need to get water. Oh, 
Oh, let me see. Energy. Extra rich water and reviving bull's blood. Exactly what good coffee water needs. Uh, oh, good grief. That was it. Oh, and that's the answer. All right. Well, now we're going to save it. I'm going to save it here, and next time... Next time around, uh, we will pick this up. Uh, we will go visit. You will. Oh wait a minute. And the water and the booze. Cool. I already have the special water, at least. Ah. Clear and clear water. Ah. Of course. So now we have the full thing there. So uh, next time around, we will make the espresso. And I think with that, we can get things straightened out and then go to Elysium with gold. Unless there's more to be done, which there probably is. <laughs> However, I hope you've been enjoying my playthrough of this. And I'm glad I have hardly had to look things up. As always, this is Rich Kale here on YouTube, a Rich Gen X elsewhere, inviting you to subscribe to the channel and check out all the playthroughs I do. Uh, besides Deponia, The Complete Journey, I'm working my way through the King's Quest series from uh, Sierra. Uh, I'm working my way through... Uh, I'm currently on King's Quest 4. I'm working my way through the Doom Guy, Doom Slayer storyline of Doom currently on Doom 2016. Uh, I'm working my way through Cassie Rain, the, the director's cut. I'm working my way through uh, Tomb Raider Core Designs timeline, currently on Tomb Raider Chronicles. I'm working my way through the Sherlock Holmes franchise, mostly in a chronological order. However, uh, since uh, Chapter 1 had come out, and I've jumped back in time to play that one, so to speak. <laughs> I'm working my way through Judge Dredd, Dredd vs. Death, and I'm working my way through Quake as well. All part of the videos that premiere at 3 p.m. every day. And I'm also uh, working my way through uh, other things that premiere at 3 p.m. in the two-week cycle. Also, every week, Tuesday through Saturday, 10 a.m., Eastern Time, and sometimes on Monday, at the same time, I have stuff premiering. Tuesday is usually a fic reading. Wednesday is a Final Fantasy VII playthrough. Thursday is um, Thursday is either Dead by Daylight or Monstrum Two. Friday is a fighting game ladder mode right now, and Saturday is a retrospective for a game I've beaten. So please subscribe to the channel, check everything out. And until next time, take care and have fun. Bye all!